You are watching The Wellness Hour, leader in medical news and information. I'm Randy Alvarez. Today's topic, new treatment options, breakthrough treatment options for people with periodontal disease. With us we have periodontist Dr. Tom McCauley. Dr. McCauley, welcome to the program. Thank you for having me, Randy. Now you say it's a breakthrough treatment option, is it? Yes, definitely. That's why I'm excited to be here, Randy. For the first time in the history of man, we have a new treatment option for those who have periodontal disease that produces minimal pain and discomfort without using conventional cutting and stitching. This new treatment is transforming the treatment of periodontal disease just like LASIK surgery has for eye surgery. Okay, now how many people suffer, by the way, with periodontal disease and what is it exactly? Well, what defines it? About 100 million people in the United States, one out of three have periodontal disease. And what it is, it's an infection, a bacterial infection that will show later how these bacteria get under the gum, invade the tissue, and cause you to lose bone. So about 40 million people actually end up losing their teeth because of gum disease. Anticipating this interview, uh, you know, researching the topic, I guess not a lot of guys are using lasers to treat this problem. Why you? How'd you get involved early on? Well, I got involved because I was I've always had an interest in the bacteria that cause the disease, and I lecture on that uh, really throughout the world. So I was intrigued by the possibility that the laser could kill bacteria in the pocket. So then I, with researchers at the University of Missouri at Kansas City, we actually did a study that documented that, and we found that it actually did kill the bacteria in the pocket. So you have very, uh, you know, published articles on this? Right, in topic. the Journal of Periodontology. And you're past president of what? of the Florida uh, Association of Periodontists, and also I'm on the board of directors of the North American Society of Periodontists. Okay, let's, tell me about the symptoms. I mean, somebody watching this, how do they know if they have periodontal disease? What, I mean, is it gum, gum problems, gum disease? Is it all the same thing? Is all the same thing, but gum disease really is an infection of the soft tissues that gets into the bone, but the way that you would know it is that you have bleeding gums, red gums, loose teeth, or bad breath, Okay. But often it's a silent disease, so you need to ask your dentist or see a periodontist to see if they get, can measure any looseness around the gums. So how is the laser different than what the, you know, the traditional, the standard way that it's being treated nationwide? Well, the primary difference, Randy, is that for surgery we use cutting, stitching, and grinding on the bone. For the laser, we simply use a laser light to okay. go under the gum. And the difference is, when we, when we lay the flap out, you can see how you expose the bone. That's a terrible picture. What are we looking at here? You're looking at the, the tissue cut and lifted up. Is this after up. the surgery or during That's the surgery? That's during the surgery. During the surgery. During the surgery. We've lifted it up. We've That's taken the procedure. Yeah. We've taken the blade and cut the gum, lifted it up. Then we, we take this, grind on the bone. So you scrape out what, the infection? Scrape out all the infection, grind on the bone, loosen it up. What is that called, by the way, that procedure? That's called flap and osseous surgery. Okay. okay. And uh, then we suture it. We take these sutures and, uh, and suture it closed, like is that. Is that painful, by the way? For well, the afterwards, it's usually pretty painful. Pretty sad. But you say that's, that's a thing of the past. I mean, with the use of this new laser, that doesn't have to happen. I mean, is that your message here today? Correct. Correct. Now, for the first time in history, as I said, we can use a laser effectively to treat the disease. And we have, we have studies where it shows that it, it, it increases bone density. And we have histology that in 100% of the cases studied, they were able to to get new tissue, and two-thirds of them, they got new bone. Okay, this, this graphic photo right here, this is how it's being done nationwide? Correct. So you call it cutting? And stitching. And stitching. Right. Is how they're, they're going in and cutting out they're, the... They're cutting it, away the infected tissue. Infected tissue. With the laser, we go in with this laser light, and we stimulate the, 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 the cells to regenerate new soft tissue and Does bone. Does the laser kill? The bacteria well, by hitting it? Well, it kills the bacteria by hitting it, and we have that animation that we can look at. So the results when, when, when you do either, either way, it, right. it, it, the bad breath goes away, the teeth get stronger. Right. What else? The result is that your gums tighten up, the bacteria are gone, you feel better, the teeth are tighter, and the bleeding is gone.